Think of Yellowstone, and most people think of geysers. Over three million people come to Yellowstone National Park each year. They want to see the park's geysers, hot springs, and boiling mud. But many don't know that all this heat is coming from a volcano. It could be the largest volcano on Earth, a volcano that lies directly beneath their feet. The Yellowstone supervolcano is hot enough to give heat to 10,000 hot water features that have been active for hundreds and thousands of years. It's a volcano that produces thousands of small earthquakes in the park each year. A volcano that has had extremely powerful eruptions in the past. A volcano that could change our world forever. The Yellowstone volcano is one of our planet's restless supervolcanoes. For scientists, the question is not whether it will erupt again, but when. Recently, park rangers noticed that temperatures of the ground were rising in some places. Geysers that had been quiet before suddenly came to life. Others went dry because they had boiled all their water. Denise Herman, a park ranger, was walking along a trail when she noticed that the area was heating up. The trees were giving off a smell like maple syrup. In fact, the heat was cooking the sap in the trees. She measured the temperature in the ground, just a few centimeters below the surface. The temperature of the earth was more than 90 degrees Celsius. The park rangers decided to close the trail. But with such a large volcano underneath Yellowstone, Scientists have learned to expect surprises. The volcanic activity continued for several weeks. Then, as suddenly as it began, it disappeared. For now, Yellowstone's volcano sleeps in peace, in relative peace. Yellowstone is truly a magical place, and that magic is rooted in the Yellowstone volcano. We have a very good volcano monitoring system in Yellowstone, and we'll know if the volcano and when the volcano starts to become excited. So until that time, Yellowstone is a great place to come and visit and experience the beauty of the volcano directly. One day, Yellowstone's giant volcano will wake up again. It will change Yellowstone as we know it. But in the meantime, and for generations to come, this giant will be a creative force, not a destructive one. The Yellowstone volcano gives life to the geysers, the hot springs, the mud pots. It heats up the wonders that have amazed many generations and will thrill many more. And it is alive right now, right beneath our feet. <laughs>